And he is Mohammed Asaf. And, and did the real Mohammed uh, say yes to the to the fact that you were making a film about him quickly, or did he uh, like the idea? Uh, he liked the idea. He was very scared. Like, listen, don't forget, the man is young man, and he twenty three, four, or something. When he won, was like what twenty four. And don't forget, you are in six weeks. You become a superstar. I think this is a. Um, 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 uh, ter terrorist attack on your uh, uh, soul and body, believe me, to become a star in six weeks. Because most of people have to uh, work step by step, you know, step by step. To, and if you fall a little, you know, you s fall a step behind, but then you go back, you know. If you jump from here to here, your fall is very big because you don't, you didn't learn the steps yeah. to become a superstar. It's a nightmare, and he realized that. It's a smart guy. He realized he lived in a nightmare. Now suddenly everybody wants something from him. Even me, I want. Like suddenly, we, I want him to act in the movie, and he you paralyzed. Ask him to play himself. Yes, yes, and he paralyzed because already is too much for him. Already he's a hero that he don't want to be. You know, like he is, he wants just to, he's a kid. He wants to chase women and he wants to drink and he wants to, I don't know if he wants to drink, but. but uh, <laughs> the women you're sure about, okay. <laughs> but suddenly he become a symbol and a hero and he can't live his life anymore. And it's a nightmare. This is why. Um, but he said yes he, to the film. He said yes and he said no, actually, not. Um, um, but at the end, he is ha now. Now he's happy with the movie, and he's even promoting the movie, and and he's he cried in the movie. But could he could he have said yes or no? I mean, could he have said no? Could he stop the film, or would you have made? No, it this is the the actually. If you want the inside stories, these kind of programs, when when you start when you enter the program. You sign that they own you for eight years, oh, even your the, life. The idol, uh, yes. Yeah. These kind of programs is if you put yourself into into their hands, they make you a star, but they own you for eight years. They sold the script, the right, his rights to a company that developed the script and sent it to me. I did not. I wasn't aware of that. He is already like he have nothing to say about it now. When when I realized. And I start working on the movie, and in the middle of the movie, I realized he actually have nothing to say about it. It's, I, I had to make a choice, you know, what to do. And the only, two, I couldn't stop in the middle, like you start, you invest, when you are invest emotionally and financially in a project, it's not easy to say, oh, ethically, this program have the rights, but ethically, they should ask him, and he don't want it. Yes, and I have to stop. If you do that, you have to pay all the cost. Yes. Now, it was very difficult decision. I tried to convince him that I will do my best for his like soul and his. Um, he wasn't convinced, but when he saw the movie, he is now very happy. I think I did a kind of balance between protecting him as uh, you know a young man and and. He's he's very like I told you he he cried because he recognized the journey very well and he's happy with the movie now, but no he wasn't happy that a, a movie will be made about him because he thought I am too young to uh, to be a star and big star and to my story will be everywhere he he felt like he didn't want it no.